Good morning, guys. It is now Wednesday, November the 4th, and I am ready for work. Just got to throw some lunch together, and then I'm going. I'm going to be working all day today, so there won't be much vlog until later tonight. Then later tonight, I think I'm going to sit down with you guys. <laughs> Funny, huh? Sit down and talk about why I'm doing this, because it seems to be on a lot of people's minds, and I just want to clear up the air. And then I'll probably get Kevin to say a few things too. But anyway, the camera will be home. He's going to school, and then I don't know if he's coming back or not. But if he does, he'll be doing some vlogging. If not, we'll see you tonight. Good afternoon, everyone. I have a late class today, so I uh, just got ready to go. It's almost 1.45, and then I'll be heading for my 2.30 class. After school, I will be going to Arna's to help her rearrange her room, so that should at least be interesting. I have no idea when Dan works till, and I have no idea when I'll be home, but I'll have the camera, so maybe it'll be a whole lot of me today and not so much a fat head. Just got out of class, just waiting for the ferry. Don't know if you can see it, but it's out there somewhere. It'll be here in about five minutes. Then we're going over to Erna's. There, now it's a little closer, you can see it better. I left school at four. It is now 5.42 and I'm arriving to my destination. Deconstructing Halloween. Silly but surely. Haha. So the project is to rearrange this room. And there's one here. So there's the three plugs. Yeah. Show my dirty room right now. Great idea! Really? One question, where's the dirt? So we're about halfway done. There's no longer a computer nor that's moved. And next up is that <coughs> and then the bed. Hi. So we have finished my room so far. Save for a couple of knickknacks and stuff that I have to find a place for, but other than that, it's pretty good. And Kevin put back together my computer. And now he is all the way in Tiffany's room, this way, helping her take apart her computer desk to the garbage. That to start with. <laughs> That's finally seeing the grave it should have deserved when I first bought it. Go, Kevin, go! <laughs> and so there goes the last of the desk. It was quite a big desk. It took three trips. Well. <laughs> yeah, exactly. She says it's very craptacular if you can't hear her. Say that again. You expect me to remember this five seconds later? Yeah, exactly. I say craptacular, disaster, ethic, shit-tastic, all creative uses of the English language that probably wasn't meant to be. Say hi, Kevin! Hi! So, my next project will be the hall closet at some given point in time. You used to be able to fit about six people in here. It goes around the corner and down some more. We said, well, Daniel's stuff in here. Ooh. Yeah, we used to be able to fit my brother's um, bedroom stuff in here. So, yes, that was our adventure. Great adventure, by the way. <laughs> and if you don't know me, I'm Dan's sister, Erna. Okay? So, I'm going to say goodnight and give way. this to Kevin. All right. Look at the kitty. Two chairs thrown out, one bedroom rearranged, and an appointment to rearrange the other room next week. I think it was a pretty productive meeting, and I got free soup out of it. Yay, soup! And I'm going to Momoya for sushi with Erna tomorrow. Maybe I'll bring the camera for that. I don't know. Depends on what Dan thinks. Heading home now. I think Dan's getting off work soon, so we should get home around the same time. And uh, then he's probably going to do that thing he talked about earlier in the video. Evening, guys. I came back from work uh, a while ago. Kevin was at my sister's all day. She saw the footage. Uh, I'm going to sit there and talk with you, kind of like heart to heart. Not really, though. <laughs> 
Actually, what I want to bring up is it's been from a number of the viewers and from a lot of uh, my friends themselves. They've been wondering why exactly it is that I am doing this. The reason I'm doing this is because I can do it. Since I was younger, uh, a lot younger actually, like the end of my teenage years, I have uh, found myself going through day-to-day -day situations where I wish I could have recorded it. Things with my other friends, uh, other moments in my life, just things that I wish I could have caught on film. And I've been watching recently on the internet more and more vlogs pop up and I thought, you know, hey, these people can do it and I've always wanted to do it and I've, it's kind of been on the back burner for the longest time. The biggest reason is because cameras uh, cost a lot of friggin' money. A normal digital camera would have cost me six fifty to eight hundred dollars. I, I just never had that kind of money to spend on it. Uh, one of the vlogs I got interested in about three months ago, uh, he's been he was using the flip camera, which is what I'm recording on. And I found out it was only two hundred dollars. I figured, well, Christ, I can afford. Not only can I afford that, I want to afford that. So. Really, honestly, the reason I'm vlogging my life is because I've always wanted to. I've always wanted to do something like this. It is my passion, and now I have the means to do so. And I mean, thanks very much for those of you who have subscribed and who are watching. Continue to watch. Um, I know it's not the most riveting thing in the world. I can't put tits on YouTube. I'm sorry, guys. I, I can't do it. And if I can videotape an explosion for you, I will. But as far as me getting any much more interesting, I'm just really just doing what I can do with my life. Like, this is me on a day-to-day -day basis. This is what I do. And uh, if it gets interesting, it gets interesting. If it doesn't, it doesn't. But that's the way it is. Want to add anything? No. No. Kevin doesn't want to add anything. The reason why Kevin's doing it is because I kind of volunteered him into it as if he is my roommate. But that's the reason why I do it. And as for it being more riveting, I'm trying to capture more and more things of what we do. I'm trying to keep the camera going for longer because I have more time. I mean, there's two hours of footage that I can take at a time, and I can just cut and crop from there. So I'm going to try and take more and more of things that happen in my life, and then if it seems too boring, then I'll get rid of it. But, yeah, thanks very much for watching, guys. Thanks very much for all your support. Keep telling your friends, seriously. Word of mouth is how I'm going to spread. I'm hoping to get very popular sometime. Uh, that's just another one of my goals, to get popular on the Internet. It would be kind of cool. But anyway, I'm done for the night. I'm pretty freaking tired. I might play some pretty Dead Space. I might not. But I'm going to cut out, unless Kevin wants to add any more footage. Grilled cheese. Kevin's making grilled cheese. Night, guys.